And the president of Ohanez Ndigbo, Professor George Obiozo, has urged the National Assembly to ensure justice, equity and autonomy based on restructuring in the ongoing constitutional review to capture the interests of the Southeast. Professor Obiozo stated this in a worry during the public hearing of the constitutional review for Imo and Abia, chaired by Senator Oji Uzokalu, the chief whip of the Senate. Imo State Governor Hope Uzadima also urged the National Assembly to use the opportunity to come out with a constitution that will address the rising agitations from different parts of the country. At the end of the two-day program, the Senator Oji Uzokalu said the committee received 48 submissions. Fundamentally, what Nibo really want is some form of internal autonomy based on a restructured Nigeria. Speaking categorically, we in Nibo are of the view that the Federation of Nigeria must be a union of equals and the government units must have the ability to sign a major plank of dissent against our constitution is that it was prepared by the military and therefore did not take cognizance of the democratic ethos and should drive a people's constitution where the general opinion of the citizenry will be properly aggregated. However, it is to the credit of the federal lawmakers that they have been doing their best to fulfill the aspirations of Nigeria for a more encompassing constitution. Bahanese have made their position a manipul man. Uh, many other civil society have made their position. It's only the floor of the House, the floor of the Senate, that I will speak my opinion. How many submissions do we have from this country? We are about 48 now with Ohanese. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.